Uh, actually, it was one of our poorer offensive showings of the year. We were not very good offensively tonight, but I love it. Uh, you know, we've been really trying to focus on defending at a higher level, and because we weren't where we normally are offensively, we had to we had to defend, and, and you know, we held them to a, what a 053 hitting percentage for the night. Uh, it's time we win some games defensively, and, and tonight I thought we were pretty good on the defensive side. Rachel Anderson, especially. Yeah. Really yeah, game. offensively they really had no answer for her, and um, you know she she's capable. She's that kind of player offensively. You have to give if you try to stop her one on one, it's going to be a long night on your side of the net. And, and a lot of the night they left her one on one, and we certainly exploited it. Sophia Serino, uh, getting, getting yeah. like five services. You know, it's good to see just because, you know, Sophia's been such a great server for us all year, and last weekend on the road, she really kind of lost her rhythm, and uh, so she worked really hard at it this week to find that rhythm again. It's great to see her come out and make plays. You think, uh, of course, the way y'all come out in the third set, the way she's strung good at those four straight services, do you think that kind of helped turn the tide a little bit in the third set? Well, yeah, you know, I think it did. She Obviously, it gave us a cushion in that third set, and, and more importantly, hopefully it gives her confidence and rhythm going forward again because it's such a weapon. I mean, it's a she puts a lot of heat on that serve, and as a left-hander, that ball's cutting tail in the opposite direction of what kids are used to, and so it's problematic when she's hitting it with the pace she did tonight.